you may have seen this before, but it's always been a classic. San Francisco Fury taking on Seattle Riot, maybe the greatest rivalry in all of Ultimate, and this time it's in the semifinals of Nationals. And already this is that new vertical stack look Riot has been honing all season as Cassie Swafford winds up a backhand towards the end zone for Sheer Stern, and that is an efficient hold. Blustery conditions, 10 to 15 mile per hour winds with 25 mile per hour gusts have kept us from getting a lot of great deep shots like this one. You can see Fury's patience here. They're all willing to let their handlers work with this. You know, the stack is not making a lot of chaos in the end zone, and it gets success. And Fardo goes to the break side for Lisa Cooper, and the game's first break goes to San Francisco. Looking for Sarah Griffith off the pole, but a zone here from Fury will take them away from any pole play and generate a block. Narayan resets back to Finney. She looks to the end zone. Double coverage intercepted there by Soper. Fury transitioning to match up person to person. Soper, cross field, tries to find Swafford, but Lynn breaks up the Ohio State connection. And there, another turn over here as the two teams get into a bit of a sloppy fest here. Lynn trying to get the block, but a call here from Soper. Fury has been very efficient, and here they will get the disc in a short field opportunity. Now towards the end zone with Narayan. Jorgensen inside backhand break. Lynn with the bookends. Rachel Bradshaw with the disc. Block there. Excellent play by Maggie Rudin. But the game continues. And now here's a deep shot. Falls a little short to Carnahan. And now Carnahan looking to find Desmond and pokes it into the end zone. Another break for Fury. Zonizer on the open side sideline. Getting high in the stall count. Goes to the end zone, and Verju's there. Great disc movement here. Nazarov advancing, and now into the end zone for Dariani. Stern with Snyder on the mark. Weatherford boosting a backhand. Dominique Fontenet, Dominique Fontenet catches it over the head of Meaty Chang. Griffith, one of three Michigan Flywheel alums, I believe in this game along with Chang and Mead. And now here's a throw from Snyder into the end zone. Looking for Verju, she hauls it in with an excellent layout grab. Her second goal of the game and Riot's back within one. Boy, in such a long reach on those throws. Johnson, inside throw, Bradshaw chases, lays out. Two layout grabs, two straight breaks. Riot's tied it back up. Now, on the sideline looking for options before she finds a reset. Cross field throw here. Now in the hands of Lisa Cooper. Cooper, high release back into the end zone. Kawhi and Jorgensen in chase. Jorgensen fights her off. Person to person here from Fury. Nice backhand whipped under the foot of Anna Nazarov. And those signature break throws from Riot as Weatherford powers one cross field. A huge layout grab from Shira Stern. Beautiful, beautiful layout. Something she you can see Fury's downfield not as active as they have been in past points. They seem to be waiting for the handlers to make these give and goes and so they can explode into the end zone like that. Finney closes on the mark. Now looking for an option inside break to Weatherford, continues to Verju, and we'll have a point to the side the half. Both teams draw even at 7-7. Inside break, Griffith back to Boyden, just a few steps away now. Into the end zone, Griffith on the goal. Riot comes back to take the first half. Groover who rejoined Riot this year after some time away from the team. Played with Scandal last year. Verju, throw to space. Griffith runs it down. Inside break there from Kawhi, and Riot's pouring it on now. Riot working 
on adding yet another break to their building collection. Cross field throw, jump ball. Brad Shaw hauls it in. Four goal lead now for Riot. Now some poaching and switching from this Riot defense. But easily handled by Fury. That's the type of possession they need. And Riot is working on getting a long sought title. It starts here in this semifinal. A block by Fury. But a call here. And Ma waving her hand. It may seem she's saying she caught that. But now the disc is in the hands of Fury. Some confusion on defense here. Finney completely unmarked. Now she rips a backhand towards the end zone. Katie Ryan catches it and one. A break for Fury. Brings the lead down to two. Has not been back and not expected to return. Hopefully both sisters are okay for this Riot team, even as they go into the offseason. Kawhi, great around break to a wide open Cardenas. Heidi looking for an option. Stall count rising. High release back in. Riot breaks again. 13 to 9. Fury's unforced errors have put them into a grim situation. She and Finney operating out of the backfield now. But Finney's options few and far between. So she fires to the end zone. And a great grab there from Katie Ryan. Late game change here to person from both teams. And we'll see who it favors. What a great layout there, but saved. Back in her way with Snyder. Snyder, blading forehand, blocked by Nazarov. Finney winds one up, puts it out into the deep space. Jump ball situation. Sure stirred. Wide pressure there from Fury generates the turn. But they will remain patient. Nazarov shimmies to free up an inside backhand a limb. She finishes it off to Austin. San Francisco will not go quietly. 13-11. Six cutters and will look for their resets to come from upfield. On the sidelines, they'll bring back a reset option but here, going forward with the disc, Boyden hangs one up, asks for a sky, gets it. Charlie Idy takes requests. She'll make it 14-11. And a drop early in the possession is going to give a short field opportunity to Riot. Fury now. Around break from Snyder. A gorgeous throw. It sounds like a force middle here. What a block. Anna Nazarov, folks. And now she's launching one for the goal, and it's in. Incredible plays here from Fury. Heroics from Anna Nazarov. Now Boyden looking deep, cross field, blocked. Knocked out of the sky by Desmond. Desmond firing it back to Nazarov. Cross field throw. Finds the hands of Carolyn Finney. And we are back to even. Fury has picked it up. It was 14-11 just moments ago. But they have battled their way back into double game point. Can they break once more? Griffith resetting. Nice inside break. Expect to see them go to the opposite direction. They do. An open Fontanet is going to catch the game winner. And just like that, Riot fends off a furious San Francisco comeback and wins 15-14.